Hi, I'm Mitch Neff. In this video, we're going to be talking about some of the new community features of the new GetIdeas.org site. There's two main ways to be involved in the community. One is, of course, via social networks on Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, YouTube, or even by subscribing to our RSS feed, which will give you automatic notification every time there's updates to the site. Of course, you can also like us on Facebook right here and let all your friends know about the community. On the site itself, there's several community features found under the My Community tab. These include activity, messages, colleagues, groups, discussions, profile, settings, and even an option to log off. Let's click on My Community and see where that takes us. You'll notice we go to the Collaborate tab in the main navigation structure. You can see right here that I have several options. One is to provide a status update. Also, I can see some of the most recent activity on my profile, such as joining a couple groups, posting a status update, and even who my most recent colleague connections are. Back up on the My Community tab, we can keep track of each one of these things individually. For instance, let's look at my groups activity. You can see I've joined a couple groups, as well as the activity that's going on in a few of the groups that I'm a part of. Also, comment frequently on blog posts and discussion threads. That way, you'll get to know some of your colleagues and can connect with them and develop deeper relationships with other education leaders around the world. Hopefully, this video has shown you some of the great community features we've built into the new Get Ideas. As always, if you have suggestions, recommendations, or any problems with the features, feel free to email us anytime at info at getideas.org or even connect with me personally on the site by sending me a colleague request. Thanks a lot. Enjoy the community. And as always, we love your feedback. Have a great day.